Hey guys, it is me, Arika Misha. And today, what I am cooking, I am cooking shrimp. And uh, it's gonna be like, I'm gonna make like a butter sauce. And I'm gonna put it over yellow rice. Um, now these shrimp that I have, these are the jumbo cooked shrimp from Publix. Publix had them on sale uh, this week, a pound for $11.99. So I got me a nice pound. And these are the jumbo shrimp. Really big ones. Big jumbo, I mean, they don't look that, they don't look that big on camera, but whatever y'all, they big. I'm trying to see if I can use my hand to measure it. They still look small. Whatever, all right. They are the big jumbo shrimp um, from Publix. So I'm gonna go ahead and get them seasoned up. And once again, it is a Saturday um, and I'm gonna cook, this is gonna be Saturday's dinner. It's gonna be a buttered shrimp over yellow rice. Y'all know I'm gonna spray them with my oil. I got my garlic herb oil bay. Uh-oh, got the wrong side open. Okay. All right, let's get these seasoned up real good here. All right, get our shrimp all nicely coated. Got some salt. All right, and we got our oil bay blackened. Blackened oil bay. Get everything all coated. I've got my shrimp all flat so they can get evenly seasoned real good. I'm going to season them up. Y'all know I'm seasoning my food. Seasoning the food. Season your food. All right, and I got some New Orleans Cajun season. Just going to put a little bit on there. We ain't trying to overdo it. We ain't trying to make it spicy. You know, we do want to have a little kick. Let's a little kick. All right, and this is... Uh, lemon pepper, just a little lemon pepper there. Seasoning on up, y'all. Let's season it on up. All right, y'all know I gotta have my parsley. Parsley on everything makes everything look good, fancy. Makes me feel like I'm eating greens. All right. Uh oh. Okay, and we got the garlic pepper season some garlic pepper season here just a little bit all right and we got our regular seasoned salt all right let's get some grind pepper get some of that grind pepper in there yep all right that's all our seasons so kind of Mix it up with your hands. I'm just going to toss them around. I could have flipped them over, but I like doing it this way. Just toss them around on my cutting board so that season can get all over. Make sure everybody getting their share of season. Make sure you guys can see. Yes, you can. All right. Seasoning our shrimp. Make sure they're all coated with the season. Season everybody all happily seasoned. Yes, they are. Happy, happily seasoned. Okay. Wash my hands and I'll give you guys a good close look at this shrimp. Alright, and the girls are in the back hanging out doing girly sister kid stuff. Zoom you guys in on the shrimp so you guys can see it. Let me take it up a little bit so you guys can see it. You know what? I'm just going to bring the shrimp over here. Hold on, y'all. Let me get the shrimp over here. It's better when I bring it to y'all. Look at that. Look at that seasoned shrimp. Look at it. Look how they all nicely seasoned. Everybody all seasoned. Evenly seasoned. Look at that. Ooh-wee. Mm. And they already cooked. They pre-cooked, so I ain't got to do much. I'm going to throw a little bit of this blackened over it. Throw a little bit more of that blackened season over it. I'm just going to make a, put it in some butter. Melt some butter and 
saute them. Put a little bit more of that New Orleans. And New Orleans gonna give them a little kick. Give them a little spicy spice. We'll make it wanna make it too spicy because my girls don't like too spicy, but alright, let me see if I can get you guys zoomed in here. I wanna zoom y'all in. Y'all know I zoom y'all in in a minute now. Let's get y'all backed up. Then I'm gonna zoom y'all in. That shrimp. Look, look. Look at the shrimp. Look at the shrimp. Ooh wee under the sea <laughs> y'all know I got kids under the sea look at that shrimp mm -mm -mm. nicely seasoned guys all right that's it for our shrimp it's all nicely seasoned when I come back we're gonna be getting it cooked with in this butter sauce we finna bake all right guys let's get it done okay guys I am back and I'm ready to do the butter sauce and get the shrimp in the butter sauce so let's get it done and of course you guys know I am using my favorite. It is the I can't believe it's not butter. Healthier choice of butter guys. But it still tastes like regular butter. So that's what I like about it. Because I'm going to eat my butter that tastes like butter. So. And this is a really good butter guys. Really good butter for you to get. So. it's I can't believe it's not butter. Really good butter tastes good and it is a healthier choice of butter especially when you're using a large portion of butter so let's get our butter in here yeah no, that's a lot of butter but we're gonna melt it down we're gonna melt that butter down make sure you guys can see Sure you guys can see real good in that pan you go get the top back on this butter all right get this butter melting Come on. get it nice and hot and melty Let that melt. Come on, butter. Waiting on the butter to melt. Butter makes it taste better. Definitely does that. Get this butter melted. He just want to do a little butter, a little bit of butter. Just to give us a sauce with our shrimp. Once again, don't forget we are cooking shrimp. We're going to grill the shrimp here in the butter. We're going to make a butter sauce for our shrimp. And we're going to put it over yellow rice. And I got my rice cooker that I got on clearance over there. I got it over there ready to do what it's supposed to do. Now that I've got my butter melted, I'm going to cut my heat down. Just butter guys. Don't forget we already have our shrimp season and the shrimp is already pre-cooked. So we're not trying to cook the shrimp again. It's already cooked. So give you guys another look at those shrimp. Look at those shrimp. Look at them. Woo-wee. All right. Let's get them in. Whoa. Let's get them in there. Go ahead. Get on in there. wiping I will wipe all day okay all right got our shrimp in there looking good in that butter remember our shrimp pre-cooked already cooked we don't need to recook it because if you do too much then your shrimp don't want to shrink and I hate when my shrimp shrink I buy jumbo shrimp I want to eat jumbo shrimp so the only thing I'm doing, I'm just going to be tossing it over in this in this butter. They already cooked. We ain't trying to cook them. They already cooked. So I'm just trying to get 
the seasons from the shrimp to the butter. Just tossing it around like that. And the season from our shrimp, that's going to go to the butter. That's going to get there. Just tossing it around. That's all we doing. And I've got it on a low heat. We don't want to cook the shrimp. We don't want to cook it. It's already cooked. So, I got this so I can just toss them around. Toss them around. Look at that. They are looking good. They are already cooked. So, we just want them to get in that butter sauce. And that season off the shrimp. Gonna go in that butter sauce. Oh, that's gonna be. All of them gonna become friends. Not best friends, but friends. All right. We got it on the low heat. I just want to make sure everybody in there, everybody hitting the bottom of that pan with the butter. Make sure everybody getting their share. See? Make sure everybody getting their share of the, of the butter. Okay. All right. Let me show you guys. Zoom y'all in some. Y'all can see. Zoom y'all in. Y'all see that shrimp starting to simmer. The butter is starting to get a little hot, hot, hot. So, we're just putting it at a low simmer. I'm going to cut my stove down a little bit lower. Cutting it down a little bit lower. We don't want the heat too hot. We don't want those shrimps to cook again. And then our shrimps start uh, shrinking up. We don't want that. So, keeping my heat low. In a second, I'm going to taste the butter sauce and see how it tastes, if I need to add anything. I probably don't, but because it looks real seasoned. Show y'all that butter sauce. Move the shrimp out the way so y'all can see that sauce. See? It's just the butter taking the seasons from the uh, shrimp. Now, you can use a spoon, you know, to um, drape it over your shrimp. But I like just doing mine, folding it, just folding it over in the butter. That's what I like doing. Same thing. It's going to get the butter off the bottom of the pan anyway. So, okay. So let's make sure everybody is looking good, looking good. Smelling delicious. I smell all those seasons. I smell the oibe, I smell the garlic. I smell the paprika, I smell the New Orleans, I smell everybody in there. I smell all the steaks in there. All of them. Mm, mm, mm. Smells delicious. Mm-hmm. Delicious. Let me taste my, let me taste my butter sauce. Mm, that's good. Mm, let me see. Hmm. Tastes good, guys. But you know what? I need to add a little bit more. A little bit more spice. A little bit more. Just a little bit more. Of the... Of the Weber New Orleans season. So you guys can see that. Yep, just a little bit more of this. Just a little bit more. Just a little bit, y'all. I know that looked like a lot, but it's not. Okay. Yeah, just a little bit more. We need a little bit more spice. Just a little bit. Get these tossed around. See, we want to keep that heat low. Because we put it on the high heat, that heat just going to... That's going to shrink our shrimp. Alright, look at that. Look at that. Everybody loves seafood. Well, not everybody, but... Gotta love seafood. I love seafood. I love shrimp, crabs. I love seafood. Alright, guys. That's it. That is it. And I just take the butter sauce and just, you know, kind of 
put it over the shrimp like that. See? You can use a spoon. Doesn't matter. Does the same thing. And you know what? I'm going to taste that one. I'm going to taste it. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mmm. That was amazing. Mmm, 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 mmm. Ooh, woo. That shrimp tastes amazing. That sauce is amazing. Mmm. Ooh, woo. Well, cut the stove off. Took us about maybe two or three minutes to make that butter sauce. All you did was just throw your shrimp in the butter. And the seasons came off your shrimp and cooks right into the shrimp. Oh, we did. And I'm telling y'all, they taste amazing. They taste amazing. You guys see them? They taste amazing. Let me see if I can zoom in a little bit more. Taking y'all in the pan. Y'all hope y'all ready. Mmm. Look at that shrimp. It tastes so good. I taste all the seasons. Alright guys, let's move on to our rice. Okay guys, just wanted to check in. Um, I just got my yellow rice. And you guys know I love that Mahatma yellow rice. Um, I just got that in my rice cooker. And if you guys saw my uh, Walgreens haul, you guys will know I've always wanted a rice cooker. Um, I've got other gadgets, you know, like the big pressure cooker, you know, that cooks rice. But I never had like a small rice cooker. So I found me a rice cooker at CVS. Um, no, Walgreens, I'm sorry. Walgreens, original price at $30.00. Y'all know Walgreens and CVS be having things overpriced, but anyway. And I got this rice cooker on clearance for $9. Yes. So, I got the yellow rice in the rice cooker, guys, that we're going to put our shrimp over. So, I just cut it on, and it is getting the rice cooked. And I will be back to show you guys the rice once it cooks. And you guys know with a rice cooker, it's supposed to be faster, so I'm going to see. But, alright, we've got our yellow rice in. And once we get that yellow rice on, we will be finished and it will be time to eat. Because the girls already been up here circling around because they smell the shrimp. They're going to smell the yellow rice too. But, alright guys, we'll be back. Okay guys, we are back. And as you can see, my rice cooker has switched from cooked to warm. So that lets me know it is done. I read the instructions. Thank y'all very much. And let's peep in on this rice and see what it looks like. See what it looks like. Ooh, that looks good. See if I can zoom y'all in. That looks good. Looks really good. You know what? Let me get it unplugged. Hold on a second, y'all. Let me unplug it. Unplug it because it is done. Look at that nice steamed cook yellow rice. And you know what? In the rice cooker, it took about 15 minutes. Not bad. 15 minutes. I think because I did a large portion, I did three cups of rice. So, all right, guys, that is it. You've seen our shrimp. We've made our butter sauce, and we've got our yellow rice. And that is our uh, garlic butter shrimp over yellow rice. Thanks, guys, for watching. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media, at Arika Misha. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to this video. And remember, knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.